All right, we're here with Angela, and uh, this is some games workshop terrain that she's done. Can you tell us a little bit about it? It was really exciting for me to get this project because I've never painted any kind of terrain before, and so I was really excited to see what it would turn out like. Plus, I'm trying to brush up on my dry brushing skills, and so it really helped me learn better techniques and methods, and I really like the color scheme and how how everything just turned out. It was really, really quite entertaining because there's so much detail that you can pull out and so many things to to pick out, to work on and play off of and to add a little bit of color here and a sh different shade here to bring out different hues and highlights. And I really liked it. It was really it's, fun. It's almost like painting a, uh, a figure. Yeah. Really, like a giant figurine yeah. with all the detail that it has mm -hmm. in it. You, you said that... Uh, you kept uh, stabbing yourself. Oh yeah, like on there's all the little parts. Like this is so yes. pointy, and then like here, you're trying to paint down here on this side, right. and like you'll scrape your hand across the little spikes. And I kept stabbing myself with it. The um, <laughs> even the, the outhouse it has like spikes in the window. Yeah. You know, and um, yeah, the Warhammer universe is an unfriendly place. It I is. think. Mm -hmm. And uh, well, these are pretty cool. The this castle set. This is also by Games Workshop. And um, it isn't uh, as modular as you might think because of the way the doors are set up, but if you can get that past that, it's definitely uh, a really nice set. It can play a lot of roles. Uh, also wanted to point out that it's on quarter inch uh, hardboard and uh, what we call footprints. So there you have it. Any last comments, Angela, um, about this project or in general? It was just fabulous. I liked it. I want to do it again. Again, again. <laughs> Thanks. The day, the, no extra charge oh. for the, for the dance. <laughs>